Hello, I'm Bob of Tom's Urban New Jersey U-Haul. If you're planning on towing a trailer with your Nissan Versa, you're gonna need trailer wiring. It's required by law. Let's break down this install. You'll need the tools seen here to complete this installation. All right, so this wiring kit requires you have to go behind the taillights. The steps that we're gonna be making, we're gonna be moving the side panels and the flooring. So our next step will be removing the scuff panel. In order to do that, you gotta remove two push panels, one here and one here. In order to do that, you wanna use a flat screwdriver. So now all you have to do is pull straight up on the panel and it comes right out. So the next step we'll be doing will be pulling the pin out on the driver's side with your flathead screwdriver. So the next step we'll be removing the paneling, folding it back to expose two 10 millimeter nuts. So once you remove your two 10 millimeter nuts, you're gonna remove the tail light. You're gonna push away from the vehicle. On the back side, there's a pin that is very, very tight. Be careful, you gotta wiggle it to get it out. So once your tail light is removed, you remove this fastener and repeat the same steps on the passenger side. So the next step you'll be doing, removing the rubber grommet and fishing your wire with the yellow wire through the hole. The next step will be cutting the rubber grommet to place your wire in. So the next step will be taking your T connection and connect it to your vehicle wire harness. All right, so let's go ahead and put some black silicone on the slit we just sliced into the rubber grommet. The next step will be taking your ground wire and ground it off on the inside of the driver's side. All right, so now we're gonna plug our T connector back into our tail light and reinstall your light. So once your tail is installed, we can take our 10 millimeter nuts and put them back on. All right, go ahead and install your nuts. And then you're gonna take your green T connector and repeat the same step on the passenger side. All right, before we start closing everything up, we're gonna talk about two options you have for your four flat wiring. You have an option you can bring it down by your hitch, you're gonna go through the vent on the side, or you can leave it down by your spare tire. If you choose to leave it by your spare tire, you're just hanging out your vehicle, and you close your trunk on it. All right, so with the wiring all set up, we're gonna ready to put our trunk back together in reverse order. So that wraps up our install. You are ready to tow. Thanks for watching. If any of the questions about this product seen in this video, or if you'd like to schedule an installation with a U-Haul Hitch Professional, visit us online today at uhaulhitch.com.